with this house together. Mother, I... I went to see Gwyn Whitehill. You did what? You would meet with the girl who once... tore this house apart? Oh, I... I see now why you went in secret. Surely you must have known I would have counseled against it. She wants to help us. She wants to bring about peace. And as much as you may mistrust her, we need help. I don't know how you can trust that. Well, what did she have to say? Lord Whitehill is plotting against us. I don't know his plans, but I fear them. And the only way he'll stop is if we submit to Griff's rule of our house. What? Would you really give up control of our house? Griff is already a torment. How much worse could it get? I have to keep the peace with Griff. Even if that means letting him have his way at times. The thought of it makes me ill. I don't like it either. Was this all? Did you learn anything more? You need to tell me. Enough with the mysteries, my son. What I've told you is nothing compared to what else I've learned. There is a traitor in our house, on our council. No, this can't be. And all our plans to save Ryan, to save this house. All gone. Roderick, who could have turned on us? Times have been hard, but I never thought this would happen. Not in our house. I don't know. There's no way to be sure. If we don't know, then we can't trust anyone. Then again, I don't know why we should believe anything that girl told you. The White Hills would love to sow dissent in our house with lies of traitors. Get in there. Go on, 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 get in Stay put and stay out of sight. Get down, get off again. Get down there and die like a good little boy. <laughs> what do you want from me? No, no, he was over there. And Ramsay was here. I'll play it how I want. You will bend the knee to your liege lord. I must speak true. I haven't the balls to defy you, Lord. What is this? What are you bastards doing? Oh, look here. It's the new Lord. You're in luck. We're just getting to the best part. <laughs> Little Lord Ethan's final breath. Unless you want to play the Lord of House Forester instead. You can't do this. You can't do this. Get out of our house! Right now! <laughs> we'll do as we please. Besides, we're not finished. You must stop. I know you've seen it before, but um, it gets better every time. Show some respect in my house. In my home. And that's what we're doing. Remembering young Ethan as he was. <laughs> oh, please, no! Say hello to your father. <laughs> oh, no, <laughs> Down. <laughs> oh, well done, well done. I'd say, I'd say, I'd say he died better than the real Ethan. Oh, yeah. Better than the real Ethan. And what about you, eh? You want to be next? Men without honour are lower than dogs. <laughs> I'd be happy to dirty my blade with your blood. You should have seen it. Your brother, he acted like a true lord. Right up to the moment Bolton's bastard put that knife in his neck. Before this is over, your blood will join my brothers on that floor. So I hope this was all worth it. It'll be worth it when I pull this blade from your neck and see the life drain out your eyes. Can Make I his ask mother you, watch. No more but now we'll really have some fun. Enough. Griff will deal with him.
when he's done, he'll own this fucking house. And he'll have more than just words for you. Take your boy out of here while you still can. Roderick! Roderick! Now is not the time. Wendell, pack the extra rations. Duff, make sure the quivers are full and the torches are dry. Garrett. What's happening? We're heading north of the wall to deliver justice to brothers turned traitor. They're hiding in the woods at a place called Craster's Keep. I've been looking for volunteers. The cowards murdered Commander Mormon. We're going to kill every one of them. And we won't all be coming back. I'll volunteer to go. I thank you for that. I need every sword I can get. But Britt's going to. He took his vows in the set. He's a brother now. I understand why you hate him. But bad blood could jeopardize this mission. Too many unknowns out there. I can't have my own men killing each other. I'll go in his place. I'm a better fighter than Brit. You'll want my sword before his. I don't doubt your skill. But I need every sword that's willing to go. Even someone like Brit. If you do come, I need to know there won't be any trouble. Even if he provokes you. Can I count on you? I need your word, Garrett. I'll be taking a chance. I'm a man of my word. I won't disappoint you. I'll hold you to that. It's a hard road to Crestus. We leave tomorrow at first light. Now why don't you go talk to those two? They volunteered as well. Make sure they're ready. Dorf! Where are my arrows? Well, what did Jon Snow say? I don't think he likes us much. Definitely doesn't like you, Finn. Haven't heard him singing your praises in. He wants to see us work together. No more problems. That's on you. Point is, he doesn't want any problems with either of you on this Craster's mission. Well, there's something you should know then. <laughs> I, uh, borrowed this from you. <laughs> what? I just got curious. I wanted to know why your uncle was here. It never ends with you. Well, it didn't mean no harm, honest. I just wanted a quick look. I wasn't stealing. Always planned on giving it back. You can't keep doing that, Cotter. Next time, ask. Well, I did try. And you said he was just visiting. But I think there's more to it than that, isn't there? I noticed this part here. North Grove. That's just some shit story for little kids. A rumor. No, it's not. Of course it is. I had it to Witch's Den where they turned children into giants. Garrett, you don't actually take it seriously, do you? It's a fairy tale. For idiots. Everyone knows that. I didn't think you were that gullible. You're wrong, Finn. It's more than a rumor. Lord Forrester found the truth, it's real. And this says it's somewhere in the north. On the other side of the wall. And here I thought you might have some brains, Garrett. You two deserve each other. Have fun chasing your tails. Good. Didn't need him anyway. What do you mean? He doesn't know about the mammoths. Or white walkers. Or how to sneak past a giant. What, and you do? But you know, it's the things you hear about. The rumors is all. I wouldn't know myself. <laughs> How could I? Rumours my ass. You're hiding something, Cotter. I'm not. They're just things I hear around Castle Blacksall. 
people talk, you know. Not about the North Grove, they don't. You do? Probably heard you talking about it. Or, or maybe one of the recruits. I don't know. What does it matter? It, it was nothing. Cotter, I know you're lying. I covered for you. You owe me. All right. All right. I've been on the other side of the wall, got it. You see, I, I live there, in the north. I'm part of the free folk. People round here call wildlings. I know, I know, it's crazy. I, I was with some other free folk. But we were looking for weapons, south of the wall. We got caught, so... So I passed myself off as a local and, well, well, they sentenced me here to Castle Black for stealing. I shouldn't be here. This isn't my place. I didn't know what else to do. Are you putting me on, Cotter? I wouldn't joke about that. They'd kill me if they found out. Are we... Are we still friends? I mean, I know it's a lot to take in. And I'd understand if you were angry. Don't worry. Bloodthirsty wildling or not, we're still brothers. That is good to hear. <laughs> At least when Mance Raider wants to boil you alive, you'll know someone in high places. Cutter! What did I say? That shithouse you fixed is still leaking. I'll be right there. I'm going back home. No matter what, Garrett. I've heard stories. Old tales of a secret forest within a forest. Your lord knew what he was talking about. You know where the North Grove is? No, but I'll help you find it. I'm deserting anyway, heading back home. I can guide you, keep you alive. Stick with me and I'll show you the way. Plenty of things out there want to kill you. Others want to eat you. All right. Even if you are a bloodthirsty wildling. I won't let you down. Cut her! Now! Uh, on the way! Please, don't tell anyone about me. The watch would kill me if they found out. Marine still smells like shit, even outside the walls. We'll find Croft here, somewhere. Yeah. <sighs> you alright? <sighs> Never better. <laughs> Back under the Mad King, they used to say death by sword was a sweet kiss. But fire would fuck you hard. Funny. No. No, not very. I'll go find Croft's tent. Asher... I need you to tell me the truth. I've come a long way to bring you home. Back in that cave, you made a choice. You must have thought only one of us was going to survive. Now, it's not a fair question to ask, but I need to know. I've been fighting side by side with Beska for four years. She has saved my life more times than I care to admit. I owe her. Thank you for being honest. But she's not family. <sighs> Look, I can't blame you if your feelings about me are conflicted. Or your feelings about going home. Your family exiled you to this place. But I swore an oath to your mother. Sailed halfway around the world to bring you back safe. And I'd be damned if some dragon fire or your Foul decisions are going to stop me. Are we clear? I'm here to help you. To protect you. I'm sorry, Malcolm. I did you wrong. Well, it's good of you to say so.